this is it here first thing to do is unfold the arms make sure that the battery is fully charged optical floor sensor is unimpeded and the camera is facing up which is what we want turn on the drone you can tell when it's on because there's a little lights flash there see them see the lights flashing okay next thing to do is put up your antennas which are fake and turn that on so that light's flashing see go up and down there we go that's sorted out next i'm going to turn on the screen recorder just to show what we got going on here start now there we go three two one okay great now once you got that screen recorder on you just go to settings look for connections Wi-Fi hit Wi-Fi and then it's KY 1080 this is the one we want so you put your finger on that and that goes in it's the one that's connecting it says very good right so once that's on come back to the FHD FPV app that you've recorded that you've downloaded off the internet okay now we're getting into the play area and what I discovered was this thing here you click that that's gravity sensor I thought it had something to do with keeping it at a specific level on the ground turns out it's nothing to do with that what this gravity sensor does if you turn it on it reacts to your phone if your phone's like that it'll make the drone go forward your phone does that it'll come backwards so i've had that on all the time not realizing what the heck was going on so i think that was a problem anyhow what we're going to do now is we're going to reverse the image because that's upside down there yeah, reverse there you go see mm -hmm. And also I'm going to push this up just a touch so it can see much better uh, that's that's altitude hold and I'm going to take it to 100% speed and click on there that tells you that there okay I'm going to click on that to also do a calibration when that goes off it means it's ready okay great that is the headless mode that one there so you know it's a 360 flip mode you can take video and photographs by using the gesture mode so let's take it up there all right see if we can get it to do that now there you go three two one took a photograph because i did that with me hand all right so <laughs> takes a photo and that should be video I think yep three two one it is taken video excellent so those hand signals actually do work I put the uh, microphone on to, for voice command land turn left turn right fly go up go right <laughs> go right <laughs> not yet an awful lot of uh, notice there okay okay um, go up all right all right that's not that does not work for me it could be my accent causing a bit of a problem for it look at that man now it's just sitting in the air quite nice i don't see, actually you should, you should never see that because once you see that it starts acting a bit odd okay so um we're getting some video there well let's take it up
Yes, the land button works great. But I just want to show you that the actual, the photographs are all right and the videos are right if you are not actually flying, if you just set this somewhere, right? If you just set this, I'm set, it's not flying, that's just um, sitting there, but I'm going to take a photograph, all right? And then take video. And I'm sure that the video actually doesn't, is not bad. That's not a, not a bad video at all. So, uh, yeah. How are you doing there? So, unfortunately, it doesn't take audio. That's what we got going on. Okay, I'm going to try the voice command one last time. Fly. 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 Rise. Drop. There's a lot of uh, <laughs> words on the screen now. Fly. Go to the magic wand thing and see what got happening here. Now then, if you look, you'll see that there's a. See, that's the magnifier. So we'll record. We'll get the um, drone to record and we'll fly it for a bit. Yeah. So now we. I'll do. See, but magnifies. Uh, look at that. That's how great it's magnifying. <laughs> I want to demagnify a bit because that's just way too much, isn't it? Well, 360 mode happening, which is this one here. Okay, take off. <laughs> oh, say that. Well, that was a fun flight with the E68. Unfortunately, they don't give you any information about that e the gravity sensor on it. It wasn't until I went on the internet and looked up, you know, what is gravity sensor is when I eventually found out where it was. And with me having that on and moving my phone around, the thing wouldn't stay still, but I didn't know where it was. I thought it was all to do with trimming. So it's flown a lot better today, much better. But it still wanders a bit, you know, I'll take a, what, a $32 drone or something. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.